I'm a regular visitor and this time uh, one of my close friends has become uh, part of the board. Where is he? Govinda. Govinda. Uh, would you like to be in the picture or yeah, yeah. no? No, you don't want to be. Okay. So, uh, therefore, uh, uh, we came uh, here with taking the opportunity. Um, I'm uh, interested, I'm uh, quite uh, pleased to see that after Jagan Reddy took over as Chief Minister, uh, he has made changes which inspire confidence of the Hindu community. And one of the things that has been done is to reinstate uh, the Chief Agama Shastra uh, priests, uh, and uh, which was done by the previous government, during the previous government's tenure. It's also given free hand <coughs> to the board to, to develop uh, further the Tirupati temple. So I think uh, uh, we look forward to more changes. Uh, I think uh, the uh, money that Tirupati receives should be fully properly audited and used for public good. Dharmakali. Uh, hmm? Dharmakali. Uh, and uh, also, uh, I would like to say that uh, the, there have been past irregularities and they must also be investigated because there has been no audit of the money that has come into the temple given by devotees how they have been spent. Um, other than that, uh, uh, I don't believe most of the propaganda that is being done by the opponents of, uh, of uh, the Chief Minister uh, Jagan, uh, that uh, he is trying to Christianize uh, the Tirupati, Tirumala areas. I have found no evidence of it. Even the propaganda earlier that the chairman of the board, uh, Varendi, he was also accused of being a Christian, but he is a very devout Hindu, and his wife is even more strong devout Hindu. So I think we should not bring in religious issues as, as a propaganda weapon, and it's not true on top of that. And uh, I, would, uh, I would like to uh, see that uh, Temples all over India improve as Tirupati temple has improved. And uh, we would like to see uh, the era of exploitation of temples to be ended.